Hey CK friends, it is Kay from Closet Keepsakes and I am here with a quick trendy thrift video for you all today. Today is going to be a collective haul from a few um, of my favorite thrift locations. I got quite a few things that I'm going to share with you guys today. But before we get started, I want to say hello to all our CK friends and hello to all our new friends. This is a channel for thrift fashion and styling with a little bit of affordable fashion as well. So now, let's get started. Okay, y'all, so we are in fall. The weather is starting to act right, finally. Um, so I did pick up a couple like basic items and a few you know other things to add to my fall closet some of these things you might feel like that's not fall but i feel like you definitely can layer it and pair it with other things in order to make it suitable for the season so the first one definitely fits the bill but um i just feel like it was a good um, basic to add to my closet um probably from now until like spring season and it is this short sleeve cardigan now it is a little oversized on me bigger than I expected and where I live like I said a lot of times the dressing rooms are not available anymore since COVID but um, I do feel like I can layer it um, it has buttons at the front like I said, it's short sleeve and it's a knit material um, so it is just a simple piece that can definitely be paired with a lot of things definitely have work in mind when I have to go into the office moving into the fall or like i said all the way through into the spring okay so the next item that i purchased and i don't have the prices on these i washed them i took all the tags off so um most of these if not all of them i believe were under ten dollars i used to have that rule if you watched some of my previous videos like i'm not buying nothing over ten dollars in a thrift store y'all but inflation is a piece of work but i do believe everything in today's haul was under ten dollars so that's kind of the range we're working with. The next piece is this jumpsuit, and this is the back. This is the front. Um, let me move back a little bit so you guys can see it. It kind of looks like a dress here at the bottom because it has like a little bit of pleating right here in the front. It does have an invisible zipper on the side, yeah. And it's a V in the front neckline and in the back neckline. Um, I thought this was really cute. It's kind of like a plaid, green and navy plaid. Once again, great for work, something I could throw on on a casual Friday if I have to go into the office or layer it with cardigans or button up shirts or blouses and things like that, turtleneck. Um, there's some things that you could definitely do with this. And I just thought this would be a good addition to my fall wardrobe. Okay, so I picked up another cardigan. Um, this one is a little different. It's tan, um, long sleeve, and it hits me about a little under the waist, or yeah, hip, waist, hip area. So it's a little bit longer. It doesn't have a collar on it, but it's in really, really good condition and a neutral color that's perfect for fall. As you guys can see, there's a lot of like basics kind of coming into this haul. But I think that this one was necessary. I do have a tan colored cardigan already, but the style is very different. It's a little more trendy than this one is. I think this is going to be perfect, once again, to transition me from fall all the way through spring. And I could wear it with a lot of different things. If nothing else, I could just throw it on over even a t-shirt. So I really like this a lot. I have another basic for y'all. <laughs> it is a navy button neck. You guys know blue is my favorite. Um, but I am like shooting to have a button up in every color. So I have options for work when I go in the office or have to travel for work. But I bought this one. It's just a simple button up collar, long sleeves. And this is the back. Now this is a men's um, button up shirt. It's not a blouse, it's a shirt. And what I discovered, because I don't really shop the men's section. I think I might actually do a thrift haul where I just shop the men's section. But um, I like the fit of it, y'all. <laughs> I like the fit. And I think that that's something I'm gonna start looking at more. If I could find button up tops or blouses or shirts um, in the men's section that fit my body well and are comfortable and of good quality, maybe that's where I need to be shopping. Because sometimes when I go in the women's section, the blouses have curves built into the top and it doesn't always fit my curves and it looks 
weird. So I really like um, this one. It does have stretch in it. So this is something that I will be trying to look for more, look more of, look for more <laughs> in the thrift store for sure. So for those who have been watching thrift hauls, y'all don't say nothing because just don't say nothing. But I purchased this one and I know this looks very similar to another blouse <laughs> that I thrifted not too long ago. The difference is, um, the pattern is actually different. The last one I um, thrifted was floral. This one is just pieces of pattern, splashes of color. Um, they both were tie neck tops. And the last one was also long sleeve. This one is sleeveless. Now I really do, I almost not, didn't get it because I have something similar, but I do think that having a sleeveless one is actually a, op, a really good option for myself. At my age, sometimes you get heated up <laughs> and you have to dress in layers in preparation for those moments. So having something sleeveless and being able to throw over, throw a blazer or cardigan over it is perfect for me. Um, so I did ended up picking it up anyways. Like I said, I almost didn't get it, but um, I love the colors on it and I think the style of it is really good for work. Or you throw it on with some jeans and some boots and keep it pushing. So I really like this a lot. Okay, y'all. So we do have quite a few pieces left to go. I'm going to try to get through them though. Let's get through them. Um, I have another basic, which is a button up white blouse. And this is actually going to be a replacement for one I already have in my closet. I feel like the other one just didn't fit my body well and we all know that this is a basic that we need in our closet this one is in really good condition it actually was like brand new it's super wrinkled because i did wash it um there's no staining or yellowing or anything like that and it fits really well i love the material it is soft and it has you know pockets in the front so i thought that i had to get it right even though i had one i definitely think i like the fit of this better and i am willing to get rid of the last one so i added this one to my closet during the shopping next trip. one now this piece was actually purchased in a set but i bought it just for this piece and i actually already put the second piece of the set in a donation bag so you guys are only going to see this one um and it is this sparkly cardigan now I had knit pants to go with it, same material as the sweater. Um, but this is a little oversized and so was the pants were really big. Um, so I decided to just get rid of the pants. It didn't look good to me together, but I love that this is V-neck. It is vintage, has gold buttons here in the front, pockets in the front as well. It's just simple in the back, but I thought this would be perfect for the holidays. Definitely can be dressed up but also can be dressed down, like throw some jeans with this and some boots or some loafers or something like that and let's keep it pushing. But I just thought this was really cute. And like I said, it's a little oversized, but we'll work with it. I think that that's part of the trends that we've seen in the past and that we can continue on. Um, I think the set altogether was like $7, but um, I was well, I think the sweater is worth it. I could definitely, like I said, share the pants with somebody else. Y'all gonna be like, what's going on? Because I picked up two sets. I don't ever shop the set section, but I did, I've been trying to look there more to see if there's anything that I do like, because sets are just like perfect. Like you can wear them separately or together and really you're getting multiple outfits, double the multiple outfits when you're um, shopping in the set, set, set section, if you could really find something that you like. So I did pick up another set and I'm going to pull it off the hanger so you guys can see it a little bit. But the first piece is the zip-up vest with the black trim pockets. Really cute. It is sleeveless. But it came with this skirt. And it is kind of like a pencil, but midi length on me at least. It has this little black stripe on the side. Elastic waist with the drawstring. It's kind of an athleisure um, style um, look. So together, I just really like this. And I think this one was less even than the gold set. I do not remember the price, but I am really excited about wearing these. Y'all, I just started taking my boots out because the weather is just now acting like it wants to be fall. So I am looking forward to putting this with some boots on, maybe a little turtleneck and layering it. Um, this to me is definitely a fall 
piece. <laughs> I don't know if it's going into the spring. Yeah, I could probably break up the pieces and take it into spring, but the material is pretty like thick. So I'm not really sure, but I thought this was really cute and I can't wait to wear it. So we're gonna end off with a few more basics. I did pick up these wide leg slacks And they are a little um a little loose on me they have a um invisible zipper of course and they're gray so it's a basic like um invisible or really like faux pockets they're not real pockets that you could put anything in but you guys know i love white leg pants i think once again it's gonna be perfect for work i could even throw on like a little t-shirt or hoodie with these if i wanted to dress those up a little bit and i didn't have a gray pair of pants that fit well in my closet. So I am gonna be looking for a darker wash as well because I can't really bank these. I can wear now, but will take me into the spring season. Um, and I just think these were just a good basic to have. So I had to pick these up as well. I believe they were like $1.98 or yeah, like about $2. So that was a great deal. So I picked them up as well. Two more y'all, two more. So this is not in season, but I figured I could layer it. So if not, I'll pack it away with the rest of my summer clothes until next time. Um, it's just this green blouse. You guys see it has some layering to it. So it has not ruffles, but layers. It's sleeveless. It does have an invisible zipper in the back. You guys can see that. But it does close up so it looks like you can't even see the zipper with all the like layering. And I just thought this was cute. Like I said, I felt like I could throw a cardigan over it. It definitely gives me spring vibes for sure. But if you're still rocking that dopamine vibe or feel into this fall and um, winter months, you could make this work. You can make this work for the holiday season with the coloring. So I was really excited about this. Don't remember how much it was though. But this is definitely something I could work with. Okay, it's the last piece. And I'm gonna say, Y'all don't be talking trash because <laughs> this piece is also very similar to something you might have seen recently in a haul, um, but it's different. It's just a little bit different. Okay, so I picked up this satin piece and I have just been looking to add some satin pieces to my closet. It is super wrinkled, um, but it does have some like pleating at the front. It's sleeveless um, and it has like this band at the waist. So it gives kind of like a ballooned effect at the waistline. Um, and then it buttons up the back. And I just thought that this would be a good addition. It is sleeveless, so it will require some layering. But like I said, just because of where I am in my age and life, layering is good for me. Things I could pull on and off work best most times. So I do like this top a lot. I think it definitely can be dressy because it's at satin but it also could be dressed down with some denim and some other elements. So I thought this was a really good deal as well. I think it was only like a dollar or something. So I decided might as well pick it up, might as well get it. So that is it y'all. That is my collective thrift haul. I know it was a lot of pieces, seasons, basics, yeah, all over the place, but I think they're all really gonna work well for me going into this fall season. Hopefully the weather stays kind of cool as we move into winter very soon. Thanks for watching. Please make sure to like, subscribe, thumbs up, share this video with a friend, and I will see you all on the next Trendy Thrift video. Bye, y'all.